was walking around in the days, but today I stand before you with nothing but praise. Oh Lord, oh Lord, we praise you. Come on, put a praise on your lips. Oh Lord, we, praise. we praise. Put a praise in your heart. Oh Lord, we praise. We praise you. Oh Lord, oh Lord, we praise. We praise. Oh, 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 oh. oh Lord, we praise. We praise. for one more day, one more month, hallelujah, one more second, one more minute, one more day, 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 one more, day. One more. One more day. he woke you up, one more day. started you on your way, one more day. put food on your table, one more day. clothes on your back, one more day, one more day, We're gonna do it one more time. One more day. One more day. One more day. One more day. One more. One more day. He saved my soul. One more day. One more. He kept me in my right mind for one more day. One more day. slow it down for you hallelujah down at the cross where my savior died down where from cleansing from sin i cried there to my heart was the blood applied singing glory to his name down at the cross where my savior died down where from cleansing from sin What's the blood of my singing glory to his name? I'm singing glory.
one trust me saved from sin. Oh, yeah. Jesus so freely abides within. There at the cross where he took me and I'm singing glory to his name. Oh, I'm singing glory. glory to Come on, put those hands together. I'm singing glory to his name. So rich and sweet, cast thy poor soul at the Savior's feet. Plunge it today and be made complete. I'm singing glory to His name. Oh, I'm singing glory, glory to His name. Name. Come on, put those hands together.
are living in a time to where the only thing that will sustain us is prayer. As the world prepares to pivot, we as the believers, we have a call. For the scripture says, if my people who are called by my name would first humble themselves and pray, seek my face, turn from their wicked ways, then I'll heal the land. We have a charge to pray for the land. We have a charge to repent and ask God to try us once again. So before we pray, let us ask God to first forgive us. If my people, Jesus, God, if you find anything that shouldn't be, take it out and strengthen. Hey, God, hallelujah, because I want to be saved and I want to be whole. Father, we come before you in the name of your son, Jesus. God, we first acknowledge you as the almighty and the sovereign God. We thank you, Lord, for your grace and your mercy. We thank you, God, because had you called some of our names in our sleep, we would not have been ready. But God, we thank you for a second chance. Say, hey, yes, Lord, hallelujah. Thank you, God, for another opportunity to get things right. Thank you for another chance to acknowledge you, oh God, as the restorer and as our redeemer. Thank you, oh God, because you didn't have to do it, but you did. And God, for that, we give you glory. You said, God, if we humbled ourselves and pray and turn from our wicked ways that you would heal the land. God, you know the time that we're getting ready to face. And God, we, the believers, we come around your throne to cry out in the earth. Save, Lord. We cry out, deliver, Lord. We cry out, Lord, set free in the name of Jesus. We pray for our government on this morning. We pray for kings and kingdoms on this morning, oh God. And we say, Lord, have your way. Because God, you said the heart of the king is in your hand. And like the waters, you will turn it as you will, oh God. We know, God, that there's nothing too hard for you. There's nothing that you cannot do. And God, regardless of what happens in the earth, oh God, we know that your hand and your ear will cover and you will listen to the call of the righteous. So we call you our father on this morning. We call you way maker on this morning. We call you provider on this morning. We call you the healer. You are Elohim. You are Emmanuel. You Roha. You're Jehovah Nisi. You're altogether lovely. You're the God that's more than enough. So on this morning, we have no reason to fear because our God is with us. You're the same God that called night day. You're the same God that called the mountains from the sea. You're the same God that hung the stars in the sky. You're the same God that delivered the three Hebrew boys. You're the same God of the furnace. You're the same God that took us across on dry land. You're the same God that was with us in the lion's den. You're the same God that sent your son Jesus. And God on this morning, we lift you up because you are God. We set aside weight. We set aside problem. And we glorify your name. We give your name the honor. Release your glory. Because where your glory is, there is deliverance. Release your glory. And chains of fall. Release your glory. In the mighty name of Jesus. Hey God. We thank you for your anointing on this morning. We want to see your hand in Refuge Temple, oh God. Show yourself. We remember what you've done, oh God, in the past. And we thank you for what you're going to do on today. 
bless your man servants thank you for the many times that you brought us out thank you for the many times you delivered us we bind up flesh right now in the name of Jesus we come against every witch and warlock right now in the name of Jesus we pull down every stronghold and cast down every evil imagination in the name of Jesus anything that will come to hinder this service we arrest it through the power of the Holy Ghost and we call it captive right now in Jesus name in Jesus name God will be exalted in this house as we declare his glory in the mighty name of Jesus in every grateful heart put your hands together and give God the praise that's due his name because he's going to move in a refuge temple hey God he's going to move in a refuge temple he's going to move in a refuge temple as a matter of fact he's moving right now reach out and touch him hallelujah our scripture reading will be coming from Exodus 14 beginning at verse 13 this is the word for the reading at this time and it reads and Moses said unto the people fear not stand still and see the salvation of the Lord which he will show to you today for the Egyptians whom you have seen today <laughs> my God you shall see them again no more the Lord shall fight for you and he, the Lord shall fight for you and you shall hold your peace just look at somebody before you take your seat and tell them no more no more wave your finger in their face and tell them no more huh Hey, God, come on, give him the finger and tell him no more. No more. Come on, say it like you mean it. No more. You won't see it no more. You won't see sickness anymore. You won't see hard times anymore. Come on, come on, come on, come on. No more. No more. No more. The enemy, you see today, you will see again. No more. Hallelujah. Welcome to the staff service. Coming from the sanctuary of Refuge Temple. Go ahead, turn up the volume, and let's have church. Everybody, put your hands together. Let's give God praise on today. Come on, I don't see you clapping your hands. The song says, Live that He loved me. God and he saved me. Buried, he carried my sins far away. Rising, he justified. Freed me forever. One day he's coming back for a glorious day. Oh, lived and he loved me. God and he saved me. Buried, he carried my sins far away. Rising, he justified. Freed me forever. One day he's coming back for a glorious day. Come on, live that he loved me. Die and he saved me. Very, very, he kept my sins far away. Right. Why did he justify? Free me. Free me forever. One day he's coming back for a glorious day. Everybody clap those hands. You know it, come on, help us sing. Live that he loved me. Living he died and he saved me.
need your power. We need your power. 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 From the pulpit to the pew. Power, Lord. Send your power. Send your power. Send your power. Send your power. 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 Your Holy Ghost power. Your Holy Ghost power. Somebody need it. Somebody need it. Somebody wants it. They want your power. So send it on down. Send your fire. Send your fire. Breathe on us, Jesus. Breathe on us, Jesus. Your anointed power. Power to save. Power to heal. Power to deliver. Power to save. Everybody clap those hands. Everybody clap those hands. Everybody clap, 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 clap. Somebody need to activate their power on this morning. Crazy, 
your mouth. I dare you to call Jesus. Do you have a praise in your mouth? I dare you to call Jesus. Call him saints. Call him saints. Call him saints. We need Jesus like we never need him before. Call him. He will be there. friendless. He will be a father to the fatherless. He will be a mother to the motherless. He's a doctor in the sick room. He's a lawyer in the courtroom. Jesus. Jesus. I love to call him. I love to call him. Do you love to call him? Do you love to call him? Jesus. 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 Jesus there is power in the name of Jesus I just want to do a temperature check real quick if you ever call the name of Jesus and it saved you somebody holler if you ever call the name of Jesus and it healed you you holler if you ever call the name of Jesus and he came to your rescue I want you to holler if you ever call the name of Jesus and it saves somebody in your family, I want you to holler. By this time, everybody should be standing because it's all in the name of Jesus. It's at that name that every knee shall bow. It's at that name that every tongue is going to confess. It's at the name that I was down at the altar calling on the name of Jesus. And he filled me with the Holy Ghost. Anybody got the Holy Ghost calling on the name of Jesus? Oh, yes. Well, all my Jesus only people. Oh, my Jesus only wave your hand. There's power in the name of Jesus. Oh, what's his name? Oh, what's his name? Oh, what's his name? I love that call. Won't you help me call him Jesus? Won't you help me call him Jesus? Oh Jesus, Jesus, oh Jesus, Jesus, oh Jesus, 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 it's first Sunday. We have to take communion. But it's something special about the first Sunday. Because this is as close as you can get to the cross and not be there. When you hold the broken body and the shed blood in his hands, you ever needed a hug from Jesus late in the midnight hour? You ever needed him to come to your rescue? And all you could do was hold the pillow and call on Jesus. Y'all hadn't had that experience? Somebody said he's a mind regulator. Somebody said he's a burden bearer. I heard somebody say he's a heart fixer. Somebody else said he's joy and sorrow. Somebody else said he's my hope for tomorrow. But I just love to call his name. And that name is Jesus. Come on, put your hands together and give God some praise in this place. His name will shift the atmosphere. His name will break up some stuff. Jesus, Jesus. Oh, yes, God. I love to call his name Jesus. We bless the name of the Lord. We bless him because he's been so good to us. He's been so faithful. 
And I heard somebody say he's altogether lovely. Hallelujah. Life now is sweet. My joy is complete because I'm saved. Y'all was real quiet on that. Anybody saved on this morning? I'm going to take a minute and let that register. Is anybody saved on this morning? Anybody got the Holy Ghost? Anybody got the evidence of speaking in tongues? Anybody been down in the name of Jesus for the remission of their sins? Can you now say life is what? And my joy is complete. Because I'm, I'm glad to be saved on. <laughs> I'm glad about it. You got some people wondering what's going on. Why you're not breaking down. Why they cracking up. Mm. Why you're not sniffing the cocaine. When they trying to navigate through life. I heard somebody say I got Jesus. And that's enough. Anybody got Jesus on this morning? I'm not trying to pump and prime you, but I'm trying to get you out of where you are because y'all been sitting too long. And God has been too good. I see one that got it. I see two that got it. You've been sitting too long and God has been too good. I see somebody else got it. I'll say it again. You've been sitting too long and God has been too good. You promised him that if he did it for you, you would praise him. You promised him if you brought him, if he brought you out, you would glorify him. You told him if you heal my body, I'll give you the glory. You said if you save my children, I'll testify. God has been too good for you to be sitting as long as you've been sitting. But when I think on the goodness of Jesus and of all that he's done for me, my soul cries out, hallelujah. I thank and praise God for saving me. I'm glad to be saved on this morning. My God in here. This would not be a heavy service. Go ahead and shake yourself. Go ahead and shake off whatever it is that's binding you. It, it, come on. If you got to shake it, shake it. Because we will not give Satan the victory. But the victory belongs to the saints on this morning. Anybody got it on this morning? Even if you don't see it, you got it. Hallelujah. So let's stay in the presence of... I stand before you to introduce the speaker on this morning. We have a speaker that is not a stranger to this house. That's what y'all waiting on, amen? But there's some of us that want to see a move from God. Oh God, okay. He is no stranger in this house. He has preached here numerous times. And on this morning, we have district elder... Robert Garrett from Wedgefield, South Carolina. When I think on the goodness of Jesus and all he's done for me from Wedgefield, South Carolina, he is the pastor of the Bethesda Church. He is married to the lovely, always the doll of the ball, Lady Garrett. Amen. And they are blessed with several children and a host of grandchildren. So we know on this morning, we're going to receive a word. He is not just a preacher, but he's also a prophet. Amen. He spoke a word to me this morning that changed my whole morning. So if I take off running on this morning, excuse me. Just know I already got a word from the Lord, from the prophet. Oh! Hey, yes, God. Hallelujah. Thank you. I already got a word from the Lord, from the prophet of God to speak directly to my situation. And he, God is going to use him to speak to your situation on this morning. So the next speaking voice that you will hear will be that of the speaker for this morning in the person of Elder Robert Garrett following the selection from our choir. They're going to bless us both, but I want you to open up your heart to receive and your ears to hear, amen, what the Lord is going to say to you on this morning. Let us receive them both with a hearty amen. Amen. And somebody say, bless him, Lord. Somebody say, so good. Oh, that was very weak. Somebody say, Lord, you've been so good. Say it one more time. Lord, you've been so good. 
Yes, God, he's been so good to us. Lord, you are good. You've been so good. Lord, you are good. You've been better than good. I can't praise you enough. I owe you my life. Can't praise you enough. Even if I try, cause you've been so good to me. Lord, you are good. You've been so good. Lord, you are good. You've been better. Yeah. 
of what the nine is gonna bring. It will be all over in the morning because God has been. He's been so good. That's why you don't need to worry because God has been so good. So good Thank you you've been you've been so good you've been you've been so good so good to me to me come on and give God praise hallelujah Somebody really needs to hear that. Ain't no need to worry what the night is going to bring. Oh, it will be all over in the morning. Ain't no need. Ain't no need to worry. Hallelujah. What the night is going to bring. Oh, it will be all over. and tell them. Oh, you can do better than that. If the Lord's been good to you, you ought to give him a praise. For if it had not been for the Lord who was on our side, then where would we be? He's been good. He's been good. He's been good to us. Hallelujah. Glory to Jesus. Hallelujah. Yes, yes, yes. He's been good. Certainly the choir have blessed us this morning. Put your hands together. Give God a praise for this great choir. Come on, give God a praise songs of thine for well, they have blessed us truly we honor the Lord Jesus Christ the head of our life the author and finisher of our faith the first and the last he that lived and died and behold he's alive forevermore truly want to give honor and double honor to our good friend and pastor amen in the, even in his absence our bishop sylvester reed come on let's celebrate him you can do better than that come on celebrate him lord i praise you and thank god for him Amen. Thank God for all our elders and ministers of the gospel. Certainly thank God for all 
our mothers, our musicians, for each and every one in the house of the Lord. Certainly want to thank God for, amen, my lovely wife, Lady Garrett. Amen, amen. What time is it? Yeah. In 21 days and 12 hours and 5 minutes, we'll be celebrating 51 years of mass. God is good. Why, oh, yes, he is. Hallelujah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Hallelujah. I praise God for, amen. When I was working, I used to text her every morning and all during the day. Now I'm home with her. Sometimes she's in the kitchen and I might be in the bedroom or outdoor, but I pull out my phone and I text her and say, baby, I love you. Glory, hallelujah. Oh, yeah. Keep the fire burning. Oh, yeah. Hallelujah. Nobody home but me and her now. Amen. But I praise God. We learned from the beginning how to stay in contact with one another. So as the kids began to get grown and move out, we got closer back together. We open up and let them in, but as they leave out, we close up the, the work. Pull it back together. And now we're back hand in hand. Praise God. I'm happy to be home this morning. Amen. Happy to see my friends and your smiling faces. I'm grateful to the Lord that our friend, our bishop, have, amen, invited us to come and share a word this morning. Could faith come by hearing, hearing by the word of the Lord? Nothing better to hear if you need faith than God's precious and eternal word. Because everything else going down, everything else going to fail. But God's word is going to stand forever. Somebody said, throw me overboard. But I've got a hiding place in God's word. Somebody say, he say that every time he get up. Well, if you invite me back tomorrow, you're going to hear the same thing. Because I know faith comes by hearing. That's our motto at Bethel Refuge Church of our Lord Jesus Christ. For a few moments, we want to invite your attention to the book of Hebrews chapter 10 one verse verse 23 we find these words recorded as follows thank you Jesus thank you let us hold fast the profession of our faith without waving for he is faithful that promise father in the name of your dear son Jesus God as we pause to say thank you this morning thank you for your word Jesus thank you for this great congregation of people Speak to our hearts. Lord, let us hear what the Spirit has to say unto the church. Do it, and we're going to praise you. 
Do it and we gonna glorify. Do it and we gonna magnify. We gonna give your name the glory. Give your name the honor. Give your name the praise. For well, we ask all these blessings in that powerful name, Lord Jesus Christ, in Jesus' precious eternal name we pray. Amen. And amen. Thank you, Jesus. For a few moments, want to talk with you from the subject, hold on, be strong, it won't last long. Come on, Shaka. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Lord, I praise you. If you're close enough to somebody, catch them by the hand. Look them right on the eyeball. Thank you, Jesus. Say this with me. Hold on. Hold on. Be, strong. Be strong. It won't, it won't. Last, long. last long. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Oh, yes. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. In fact, I wish somebody would turn up your attitude a little bit and look back at them and tell them, hold on. Hold on. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. If we would be honest with ourselves and with everybody else, we could say that there were times when we felt like giving up. Thank you, Jesus. Times when you felt like throwing in the towel. The pressures of life was trying to tear you down. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. And most of us got it down pretty pat. We weep and we cry and we wash our face and we come out smiling. Thank you, Jesus. But deep down inside, you are wrestling with all kinds of issues. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. But I believe this morning that everything that's been holding you has got to break free. Hallelujah. In fact, I feel some, the grip loosen up on somebody right now. Thank you, Jesus. Somebody getting the victory right now. Thank you, Jesus. It won't last long. Stop by to tell you that every one of us is dealing with an it. Thank you, Jesus. Your it is not my it. But the it is real. It's not some fairy tale. And I don't know why some folks say to you, when you're going through your storms, they say, I know exactly what you're going through. But I stop by to tell you, if you haven't walked a mile in my shoes, then you don't know 
exactly what I'm dealing with. You got an idea, but you don't really know what I'm going through. Hallelujah. And this it, you pray and you fast, but it's still right there buffing you, telling you you can't make it. But the devil is a liar. He was wounded for our transgression. He was bruised for our iniquity. The chastisement of our peace was upon him. And by his strife, we are healed. Anybody know you're healed this morning? Hallelujah. Oh, yeah. Hold on and be strong. Praise our God because the God that we serve is faithful. Uh, oh, yes, he's faithful. Uh, no matter how long it's been, it's faithful. Uh, and I stopped by to say that some of us have been going through stuff for a long time. Some of us have been wrestling with some stuff for a long time. But you have what you say. If you can say it out of your mouth, it'll come to pass. The Bible says, call those things that be not as though they were. Oh, yes. Hallelujah. In fact, I believe it's time to say it again. Grab somebody's hand and tell them, hold on. Be strong. It won't last long. Now unto him that is able. Woo! to keep you from falling and present you faultless before the only wise God our Savior be glory the majesty and power I come to say to you hold on Drop your anchor and wait on God. Cause they that wait upon the Lord, you shall mount up like wing like a eagle. You're gonna run and not be weary. You're going to walk and not faint. The Bible said that out of the mouth of two or three witnesses shall every word be established. Now, tell at least three people, hold on. Hold on, help is on the way, praise God, for no weapon formed against you is going to prosper, praise God, when I talk to God, and I say, Lord, what shall I say to refuse? And the Lord woke me up about four o'clock. Say, tell them to hold on. Hold on when it don't look good. Hold on when it's fighting against you. Hold on when you're in trouble. Hold on. Don't let the devil tear you down. 
Everybody, hold on. Be strong. It won't last long. In fact, it's over. What you're going through is over. Anybody in here feel like it's over? Tell him hallelujah. If you know it's already done, for by the time somebody left some problem at your house, but I come to tell you that by the time you get back home, God would have already fixed it. God got your address and he knows where you live. By the time you open your car door, somebody gonna break out in a shout. Hold on. Hold on. Somebody. Somebody. Touch a neighbor. Your neighbor. Hold on. Woo. I feel. I feel a breakthrough. Walking down the aisle. Praise God. It's your praise that's bringing your breakthrough. Praise him with the keyboard. Praise him with the organ. Praise him with the drum. Praise him with the saxophone. Let everything, let everything, let everything, woo! let everything that has breath, praise God, praise God, praise God, it's over, praise God. Praise God, I'm free, free at last, free at last, thank God Almighty, I'm free, there's no chain holding me, praise God, praise God, Woo! Let me tell you, I laid in intensive care, and the doctor said, what you have, I can't remember the name of it, but it had something to do with acid in my blood. Praise God. And they said, what you have can kill you. It'll take you out. And I laid flat on my back. And I called on the name of the Lord. And round about three o'clock, nobody opened the door. Nobody opened the window. But I heard when somebody stepped in my room. And when he stepped in, that acid disease stepped out. And the next morning, they said, Mr. Gary, we got to take you out of here. Because you don't need this medicine no longer. We find no sign. 
We find no sign. Shit, somebody, hey. Tell them they found no sign of sickness. How many know that the same Jesus? Woo! The same Jesus. Woo! Grab somebody's hand. Share them the same Jesus. Is getting ready to work on your situation. What are you going to do? Are you going to stand there and look strange? But are you going to pray in him? Pray in him? Pray in him? Pray in him? Yeah! 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 Praise God! Hold on! Hold on! If you can't move, drop your anchor and wait. Drop your anchor and wait. Oh God, I hear something in my ear. The Lord said, Your wait is over. Yeah! 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 Praise God! Praise God! November the third, twenty. 24 round about 12 14 a miracle is coming your way all you got to do is receive it say it's mine say it's mine say it's mine this wait is over hold on hold on you see when I was a young fella I could dance damn dance all night but one thing I see today praise God when the young people get to going, they all over the place. Now I'm wondering, do I have somebody that got the nerve to get to seven people and tell them, hold on, be strong. Oh God, can you do that? Get a witness. Get to somebody. Tell them, hold on. Hold on. Hold. 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 Woo! Woo! Hold on. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah! Hold on! Oh God! Be strong! Be strong! It won't last long! Oh God! We don't want to hold it! But everybody's standing! Everybody's standing! Stand there. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Somebody here is sick and tired of being tired. You need deliverance. Thank you, Jesus. 
I know you've been faithful, but God want to move some things out of your way. Thank you, Jesus. I need you. If you know it's your hour, take somebody by the hand and say, come on, walk with me. Oh, come on, Mashaka. Take them by the hand. Bring them with you. Oh, come on, Shaka. Come on. Come on. Come on. Somebody's tired. Somebody's tired. Somebody's tired. Somebody's tired. You have held on. You held on. How come I'm a shocker? You held on. How come I'm a shocker? Lord, bless him now. Lord, bless him now. Somebody help me shout hallelujah. Yeah. 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 Oh. 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 Yeah. Yeah. Hold on. Be strong. Come on. Come on. Come on. Hold on. Be strong. Hold on. Be strong. Yeah. 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 Hey. Daughter, hold on. Daughter, hold on. Hey, 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 hold on. Be strong. Yeah, daughter, hold on, daughter, hold on, yeah, woo,
for your miracle. It's already. I believe.
Yeah. 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 at somebody quick look at him look at him and say this with me say neighbor you can make it if you just hold on hallelujah 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 you might as well praise him now you might as well praise him now God is moving stuff. God is moving stuff. God is moving stuff out of your word. Hey! Oh! 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 Look! Look! He's in here. Look, look, he's in here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Lord, I pray. Lord, 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 I pray. Yeah. 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 Oh, yeah! Oh, yeah, Chakama! Oh, yeah! Yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. 
yeah 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 Woo 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 Yeah, yeah go up, blessings come down. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank God. Thank God. Somebody going home with a miracle. Somebody going home with a miracle. The Lord bless you. The Lord bless you. The Lord bless you. The Lord bless you. Yeah. For the scripture says it is more blessed to give than to receive. We want you to prepare to give as unto the Lord. You can't beat God giving no matter how you try. No matter. No matter. No matter. As we prepare ourselves to give. When you get it, on this morning encouraging us to hold on and be strong in the name of Jesus we pray for the manservant on this morning and ask God to give strength back to his body in the name of Jesus Christ strengthen him Lord touch him now in Jesus name restore unto him what he poured out to us through the unction and the move of your spirit in Jesus name while we are preparing to give out of reverence for the souls that we have on the altar the deacons are asking that you please do not lay your offerings on the altar but to place them in the basket. Please come around quietly. In Jesus' name, place in your tithing and your offering in the basket. Lord Jesus Christ, we thank you. Lord God, for this offering as it is received. Bless it for the upbringing and the uplifting of your kingdom. Bless every gift and giver. In Jesus' name, amen. You are now under the instruction of our ushers. Again, please move quietly as we reverence the soul that is crying out. I know that God can. Hallelujah. And I know that he will if we reverence the move of his spirit. Place in your offerings in the basket. You can also give via GiveLify. 
tap give and it's done you can give your offering via Givelify. simply tap give and it's done in Jesus name So that we might continue with the move of our service, we ask that you please give way to the screen for the announcements in Jesus' name. We are sad to announce the passing of one of our very own, Elder Willie Gladney. Please keep the Gladney family in your remembrance for prayer. Funeral services will be held Monday, November 4th at 2 p.m. at the Fairview Baptist Church in Newberry, South Carolina. Please keep the Gladneys in your prayers. In Jesus' name. We know and we serve a God that is able to heal the broken heart. The Refuge Temple Music Ministry presents I Hear the Sound of Victory on Saturday, November 16th, 2024. This will be a day of guest speakers. There will be workshops. Uh, the workshops will be taught at 11 a.m. And that is for everyone can attend that workshop. There will be teaching on the Levitical order and preparing for praise and worship. That is on Saturday, November 16th at 11 a.m. And then this house will be filled with guests from across South Carolina. The guest speaker will be Bishop Brian Dykes from Christ Harvest Ministries Incorporated. He is the pastor of Christ Harvest Ministries Incorporated. You're also asked to remember that the missionary service will take place via Zoom this afternoon at 4.30 p.m. Everyone is invited to be a part in any of all of the services that you've heard. Again, please remember the sick and shut in and the bereaved in your prayers. In Jesus' name, God is a good God, and we thank him for the word that we received on this morning. A great encouragement, a dynamic word for the body of Christ. In such a time as this, God is indeed up to something. And when the waters are troubled, it's not time for us to look around and wonder what's going on, but it's time for you to jump in, amen? Because the angel would come at a certain time, hallelujah, and all that jumped in received their healing. Anybody need healing on this morning? <laughs> healing for your mind, healing for your body, healing for your soul. We serve a God that is able and he will heal in Jesus' name. We want to acknowledge any guests that we may have in the house on this morning. If we have any guests, wave at us. Let us know who you are. We would love to see you. We have one hand in the back. God bless you, my brother. We thank God for you. And I will say this. Once you've been here once or twice, you're no longer considered a guest. Amen? But we look at you, start looking at you as one of our own. So we thank God for you. And for any and all of our guests, we thank God. We thank God for seeing Elder Tracy Peel in the house with us, for being a part of our worship. 
while the Lord is still moving and his presence is still here, we want to prepare our hearts for the communion hour. This is not just something we do out of tradition, but it's something very sacred and very holy. We do not take it lightly, amen, when we partake in the broken body and the shed blood of our Lord Jesus Christ. This is as close as you can get to being at the feet of the cross where his body was broken and his blood was shed and blood and water came spewing out. And I imagine that spewing out taking place and falling on all of the onlookers and those that was there. So let us not take this lightly as the missionaries are moving about and preparing if you have not, and I ask that you please remain seated until instructed to stand. If you have not received your portion of the broken body and the shed blood, please raise your hand and the missionaries will come to you swiftly that you may receive in Jesus' name. If you've not received, we have a hand here in the front of one of the elders. Let us take this time to quietly reflect and ask God to shine the light from heaven on your soul. And God, should you find anything that shouldn't be, I ask that you take it out. Lord, I repent for any unrighteousness, any impure thoughts. Close your eyes and talk with him for a moment. In the name of Jesus, Lord, wash me over. Forgive me. Wash me over again. Every eye is closed. No one should be looking around. But this is a time to reflect and discern the power of the cross, the forgiveness, the shedding of blood. Lord Jesus, may we all stand at this time as one body. In the name of Jesus, 1 Corinthians 11, 26, for as often as you eat this bread and drink this cup, you do show the Lord's death till he come. Wherefore, whosoever shall eat this bread and drink the cup of the Lord unworthily shall be guilty of the body and blood of the Lord. But let a man examine himself, and so let him eat of the bread and drink of that cup. For he that drinketh and eat, for he that eateth and drinketh unworthily, eateth and drinketh damnation to himself, not discerning the Lord's body. For this cause many are weak and sickly among you, and many sleep. For if we would judge ourselves, we should not be judged. We discern the works of the cross. We discern why the body had to be broken and the blood had to be shed. Let us pray, Lord Jesus Christ, we thank you for your great sacrifice. The sacrifice you made on the cross. We know the power and the works of the cross, oh God. Thank you for your blood that forgives us and washes us and gives us power and allowed us a second chance. Thank you, Lord God, for trying us once again in the name of Jesus Christ. And as we eat and drink of this body, let the works of the cross be made manifest in us for every nail, every whip, every strife. Hallelujah. 
you endured the suffering and the pain and the agony for us. And we thank you, Lord Jesus. 1 Corinthians eleven twenty three. 23, for I have received of the Lord that which also I delivered unto you, that the Lord Jesus, the same night in which he was betrayed, took bread, and when he had given thanks, he broke it and said, take, eat, this is my body, which was broken for you, this do in remembrance of me, eat of the broken body. Lord Jesus, thank you, Lord. Thank you for enduring the cross. Thank you, Jesus. 1 Corinthians eleven twenty-five. 25. After the same manner also he took the cup when he had supped, saying, This is the New Testament in my blood. This do ye as often as you drink it in remembrance of me for as often as you eat this bread and drink this cup you do show the lord's death till he come drink of the cup of salvation which is redemption and healing drink ye all of it in the name of jesus thank you for your blood lord hallelujah thank you for your blood your cleansing blood Thank you for strength. Thank you for more joy. Thank you for enduring the cross. Thank you, hallelujah. Thank you, Lord Jesus. Thank you, God. We thank you. You didn't have to do it, but you did. You hung there for me, hallelujah. You hung there for me, hallelujah. Hey, God, thank you. Hallelujah. In Jesus' name. Thank you, Lord. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, God. Hallelujah. Mm. Thank you. Hey, God. Lord, we worship you. We worship you, God. Healing is in the house because of the blood. Deliverance is in the house. Freedom is in the house in Jesus' name. Thank you, Lord. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, God. Jesus. While we in his presence. Just for me. Jesus. Oh, yes, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. For me. Can we worship him at the cross? He did it just for me, just for you. Just for me. And we thank him. Lifting holy hands. And let us sing it out. Just for me. Just for me. Just for me. Every grateful heart. Yes, Lord. Just for me. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you. Just for me. Lord, we thank you for doing it for us. And God, because you did it, we're going to hold on and we're going to be strong. Lord God, bless every household that's represented here on this morning. We apply a blood covering right now in Jesus' name that the enemy shall not come nigh they dwell in. Lord God, take us through next week. Give your angels charge over us. Bless your men, servant, on this morning. We thank God for the word. Hallelujah.
on this morning. Bless this house in Jesus' name. We are dismissed in the presence of the Lord.